Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. Today I'm doing another Walmart shop with me and I'm pretty excited about this one. This is probably my most excited for video that I've done in a really long time. And I even parked on the market side this time because I'm gonna be going in Walmart and I'm gonna be searching for all of the new snacks and food that I've never seen before or that I think you've never seen before. So you guys know how passionate I am about finding new things. If you follow me over on Instagram, I'll leave my handle right down below. If you follow me on Instagram, you know I'm always doing shot with me's on my Instagram stories as well. So make sure you follow me there. But I'm just so excited. I think this is gonna be one of my favorite videos I've ever done. But before I head on in, I wanna show you that I did grab two boxes of Cotton Candy Crunch when I was in Target earlier because the last time I came to Walmart, I could not find it. And it's literally, the best cereal of life so i just wanted to show you guys that really quick stay tuned to the end of the video because if i do buy anything in here i will probably do a small haul at the end when i get home so with that being said let's go ahead and head on in and see what we can find y'all i'm so excited i got a good buggy or should i say shopping cart but you know down in the south that's what we say we say buggy okay so i'm about to start and i'm gonna be going down every single aisle y'all looking at like everything on the shelves so hopefully this won't take me forever but i want to know before i begin do you start at the back of the grocery store or the front of the grocery store when you are shopping let me know i always start at the back okay so i want to go ahead and show you the first thing that i found is this flaming hot white cheddar popcorn we actually had this at the beach so it's not new to me but i know this is a new item that just came out so i thought i would share it with you guys alex said it was pretty hot but he said the flavor was perfect Okay, so if you watched my grocery haul from Sunday, you know I've been looking for the strawberry soda and the Great Value brand. They do not have any, which is crazy, but they do have this peach flavored soda and this fruit punch. So I don't know if that's good or not, but I thought I would show you. So I don't think this kiwi strawberry vitamin water is new, but I thought I would show you just in case because I've never seen it before. So I found this orange and cream sparkling water i've never seen this before but 74 cent and my girls love sparkling water so i think it'd be worth a try so you already know how i feel about the dark berry dr pepper they have plenty doesn't look like they're running out anytime soon which is good and then i thought i would show you this new mountain dew they just came out with it's called liberty brew i have tried it it is okay it's not my favorite but it's not bad i just prefer to stick to my dr pepper this Pepsi Berry has been out for a couple months now. Some of you may already know this, but Walmart has started carrying their own brand of the cold brew vanilla latte. It is $1.98 for the little bottle right here. I absolutely love cream soda and I love drinking it out of a glass bottle, but check it out. They have orange cream also. That's exciting. So if you remember back in the day, Smirnoff used to be just in a bottle. Well, now they have it in cans. They have strawberry, margarita, original, and raspberry, and it's only $11.99. So definitely pick this up. I know this is probably really good. Okay, so if you're like me and you're just not a huge fan of drinking beer, I will show you one that it's fairly new. It's been out for a couple of years now, but it will make drinking beer so much easier for you. This is what I'm talking about. So you guys know I already love anything blueberry flavored, but this right here, this Red's Blueberry Ale, so, so good. So I shared this on Instagram last week. They now have the chocolate stock cold brew coffee. I'm not a huge chocolate coffee drinker, but I do love this. This is my favorite coffee, unsweetened cold brew coffee. But if you like chocolate coffee, they have came out with a new one. You'll be surprised the stuff you find when you're actually looking I've never seen this before. It's probably old as dirt, honestly, but I've never seen it. And I think I might've seen this before, but these look really yummy. And then they also have this guava pineapple down here. I just like that one for the packaging. This is also a newer product. I have purchased this before. I did like it a lot. The girls were not a fan of it, but it's a little bit different. But if you are into strawberries and cream, you would love it. So Pillsbury has these new apple filled crescents and then they also have a cherry filled as well. This is not too new, but it's new enough for me to show you guys. This is one of the best creamers I have ever tried. It's a great value brand, butter cookie. It is so amazing. This marshmallow cookie dough is also fairly new. 
I don't know if these are new, but they look good. So I just thought I would show y'all. Okay, so these dunkers are new. And you guys know this definitely caught my eye right away, cotton candy. That looks so, so good. So I've been seeing this for a while, but it is a new product. So I thought I would go ahead and show it to you. These Cheesecake Factory desserts, they look delicious. All right, so I'm so excited right now. I just started drinking Simply Lemonade and I just found this Simply Lemonade with blueberry. You already know, it's coming home with me. So I don't know if these birthday cake cookies are new, but I've never seen them before. If you've tried them, let me know if they're good. Okay, these are fairly new, but I'm not a huge fan. They're just too crunchy to me, honestly, but just thought I would show you just in case you like that kind of thing. Okay, this is definitely not new, but who remembers potato sticks? That was like the childhood snack of the century. So I just found these white cheese crackers and these cheddar cheese crackers in Walmart brand. I did not know that they had their own brand of Cheez-Its, but these look exactly like the other ones. I'm very tempted to try them. I bet those are really, really good. Okay, so it says these Buttermilk Ranch Snyders are new. I think I might pick these up because they look so good. These aren't like really new or anything, but I never see anybody pick these up. They're actually pretty good. I've tried the strawberry. So I showed these in my most recent grocery haul. By the way, I'll link that down below for y'all. Um, I tried the Chocolate Lovers in the grocery haul. I did a taste test, but they also have the Fudge Drop. If you're interested, they were pretty good. Let me talk about something else that's really good. These cheesecake fudge drop cookies, they are the bomb.com. So has anybody seen these new Nutter Butters? I feel like they are like bringing back something from the past. Let me know, maybe I'm going crazy. It says 2010s were nutty for the likes. Not sure, but I know these are new in stores. And just some new Oreos. They've got the Marshmallow Moon Oreos. And then they also have these dark chocolate ones. I have not tried either one of them. And then I also found this carrot cake one, which I don't like carrot cake, but these are new as well. Y'all, let me know if I'm behind on the times. Are these Flamin' Hot Puffs new? I know they had Flamin' Hot Crunchy, but I've not seen the puffs before. I don't think. Okay, so I found some new cereal. I found the mint chocolate drumstick, the classic vanilla, which I think would be really good, the cinnamon roll phyllos, the Hershey ones, which I've actually tried, and then the blueberry Cheerios, which I've tried as well. These are both really good. So I know these Oreo pie crusts are not new, but oh my gosh, they just look so good right now. Then they have these yummy mug treats. Mug treats have been out for a while. This blueberry muffin one is my favorite, along with the birthday cake one. They have a bunch of different flavors. Then they have these little chilled treats, lemon mousse, key lime mousse, chocolate mousse, and French vanilla. This looks so good. I'm so tempted, but I won't. So these are new to me, crafty cooking kits. They have s'mores, cookie dough, they even have, of course, unicorn. I feel like they have unicorn everything now. And then these are not new, but I don't think I've ever showed them before on my channel. Just these little rainbow marshmallows. And then I have these back here. Okay, it says these are new. These are Jello Pudding Pops. This is like a little kit, I guess, where you make them. They look really, really good. I showed these stuffed puffs. They're like marshmallows filled with chocolate. I showed these on my channel in a grocery haul a few weeks ago they're okay. I would recommend heating them up in the microwave because the inside is more like a powder, but they are not bad. Well, doesn't this just look delicious? So I did show these on my channel this past week, and I think I've showed them several times before, but if you have a boy, this is something new that I have not seen before. They have the green and the red now, so that's really cool. So we don't really buy these little Hostess cupcakes in my house because I just don't like these for some reason, but they do have the mermaid ones, which are really adorable. And then they have this limited edition orange cream pop Twinkies. Again, not something that is my favorite, but they are new. So I'm pretty sure the chocolate frosted flakes have been out for a while. I've never seen the cinnamon. And then I have tried this banana cream, but it is new. I still thought I would show it to you guys because it is pretty good. So I just found this unicorn fruit loop 
mix. It's in the Magic Cupcake flavor, so they probably are pretty good. Limited edition. And they've came out with all the Lucky Charms you can think of. They've got the chocolate, they've got the Frosted Flakes Lucky Charms, and then they've even got the Fruity Lucky Charms now. So like I told you before I came in here, they're out of the Cotton Candy Crunch. I knew they would be. And I did find this, Red, White, and Blueberries. Interesting. And they have the new Strawberry Crave and the Cinnamon Crunch Crave. I have not tried either one of those, but those are also new as well. I feel like they have so many new cereals. I just cannot keep up. But I just noticed these new chocolate peanut butter pops. And they have the Toy Story 4 Carnival Berry. I guess those are some kind of Fruit Loops, I'm not sure. They have the Strawberry Pop-Tart and the Brown Sugar Cinnamon Cereal. They have the Cookies and Cream Pop-Tarts. And then I found this mermaid cereal down here. I guess this would be like Apple Jacks. And I know these have been out for a while, but I still haven't tried them, the Cookies and Cream Dip and Dot cereal. Let me know if they're good. So this is a new cereal too, and I know you're probably thinking, no, it's not. Well, the keyword is mega stuff. This is one of my favorite cereals in the world. When they got rid of it back in the day, I was so sad, but then they brought it back. So here is the regular Oreo O's, so delicious. And then these are probably just as good. Sour Patch cereal, Nutter Butter, Vanilla Banana Pudding, Chips Ahoy, Strawberry Rice Krispies. I don't think this is new. Actually, I know it's not new because I've seen it forever, but I've been wanting to try it forever. They just don't make a box of it. How crazy is that? I do not need this entire huge bag. So, who makes this? Whoever makes this, please make a box. Y'all know I've been raving about these birthday cake fiber one bars for a while. They are so good. The brownie ones, they're good. They're not new, but they're really, really good. And then the coffee cake, I don't see them very often. I haven't tried the coffee cake, but I bet it's really good. And then the lemon, I have tried it as well, but the birthday cake is still my favorite. They also have these protein one bars, strawberries and cream. I did buy these, they are pretty good. They don't leave any kind of like aftertaste. So that's a plus. And then these are completely new to me. These Nutri-Grain Bites. They have Strawberry Blast, Cinnamon, or Awesome Apple, and Grape-tastic. Can you believe that I've never tried these? These are not new new, but they're new enough. They are just the chocolate covered Ross Krispies. These are pretty good. I have tried the vanilla and the cookies and cream. And they brought a few back, the peanut butter, the vanilla milkshake, and the strawberry milkshake Pop-Tarts. These were so delicious. I loved these. And then I'm not sure if these are new or not, but I don't know if that I've ever seen them before. They look really, really good. And then I'm sure you guys have all seen the Pop-Tart bites. They are not that new. They've been out for a while, but y'all, let me tell you, I am not a huge fan of Twizzlers, but I ate this entire bag. Yes, I'm guilty. And then they also have the orange cream ones, orange cream pop. These are pretty good too. I have tried these as well. And then they have these right here, which are in the flavor sweet and sour. They are red and yellow. And then my girls absolutely love these sweet tart ropes. And I just found some sour apple ones. I'm used to them getting the strawberry and cherry. You can see them over there, but this is new. I've also never seen this Oreo Big Crunch Bar before. I know some of you are probably thinking, okay, Mackenzie, I've already seen that before. That's not new, but some of this stuff is completely new to me. So you have to let me know anything you see in the video that has been out for a while. I'd like to know. They do have this new pizza dipping sauce. Well, it's not that new, but it's new enough to show. And I have tried it. I think this is the one I have. It's good, but it's not worth $2.98. And then they also have these little ranch dips now. This is bacon ranch, and then this is just original. These just look so gross. And these just look so good. These frozen bean, 
frappe blends are pretty interesting. I've never seen these before. Y'all know what's right around the corner? Fall. I need this. So this is definitely not new, but a lot of people don't know about it. It is so, so good. It tastes just like the little airplane cookies you get when you fly American Airlines, or I think Delta does it too, or they used to. And then they do have a great value brand. I've just never tried it. I do plan on trying it in the future. It is about a dollar cheaper. Here you go, guys. It is Christmas in July. So these are pretty new. These have been out a couple months, but they are worth every bit of that $2. So, so good. And then I purchased these Fruit Fetty mini donuts the other day. They taste exactly like Fruity Pebbles. I don't know if these are new or not, but they look so good. And here's another limited edition birthday cupcakes by Hostess. Sorry if it gets kind of loud now that I'm up towards the front, but you're gonna probably hear the registers and there's gonna be some kind of background noise from all the freezers. But I apologize in advance. I'm about to show y'all some good stuff. Let me know, have you guys tried these farm rich American grilled cheese sticks? Check these out. Cheeseburger bites and pulled pork bites. I bet those are really, really good. I have never seen those before. So these could have been out for a while, but they used to have cotton candy ones and they were so good. I wish they would bring them back. These look so delicious. So I just found these waffle breaded chicken strips by Tyson. Very interested. I wonder if they taste like a pancake on top of a chicken strip. Curious. I'm so sad that I'm so far away from home or I would totally get these. They look so good. They would melt before I got home though. Oh my goodness, I'm so upset. I need these in my life. Found something else, strawberries and cream. Can y'all tell I like strawberries and cream and blueberry everything? Once again, if I was closer to home, I would totally buy these for the girls. They would love these. I might just be really late to the game, but I've never seen these fruit bars at Walmart. They are the great value brand. They have pineapple, coconut, strawberry, and grape. And then I just want to show you some of these toaster strudels I have tried recently. The Cinnamon Toast Crunch, the Donut Shop, and the Hershey's. They are all very good. And I just found these cream cheese and strawberry ones that I have never tried before. Alright, so check out the Bubblegum Ice Cream. Great value brand. They also have this Unicorn Sparkle cake flavored ice cream with a magical purple frosting swirl and candy confetti pieces. This is not new, but it's so, so good. This is also not, well, it's new, but it's not new to me. I've been buying this for about two weeks now. You've probably seen it in a past grocery haul. This is so good. I'm gonna keep buying this over and over. This is my new favorite ice cream. Birthday ice cream cups, white cake flavored ice cream. Okay, and then they have these down here for $2 more. Same thing. And they have the new Sour Patch Kids ice cream, the Kit Kat ice cream, the Harley Quinn Diamond Days, and the Krypton Superman cookie dough. Got some Ninja Turtle ice cream, and you know they're gonna milk that Toy Story 4 for all they can. This is the Carnival Churro Cravings flavor. And then here is a new limited edition. This is homemade style Carolina peach pie ice cream. All right, so they also have these new Cool Whip mix-ins. They have the Oreo, and then they also have the birthday cake, which if I liked Cool Whip, this would probably be my favorite. All right, now that I'm home, I am gonna show you the three things that I did end up getting. You guys saw me put this in the buggy. It's the Simply Lemonade with blueberry, so I'm excited to try that. I did end up getting the Ranch Snyder pretzels. Yes, I forgot what these things were, pretzels, yes. Limited edition, so run and get these. Ranch, everything is life. And then I also picked up these little bites because the girls love these. And this is in the strawberry yogurt flavor. I've never seen these before, so I'm assuming they're new. Maybe I'm wrong, it doesn't say new on it anywhere but hopefully they're good. And I really hope you guys enjoyed that video. I enjoyed filming it. It did take some time to put it together, 
because as you know, there's a lot of people walking around Walmart, but I finally made it through. It took about two hours to film. I do not know how long this video is going to be when I edit it, but it was so much fun. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing all the new stuff. Comment down below what's your favorite. Let me know what you're gonna go run to the store and get immediately. With that being said, if you like this video, remember to give it a thumbs up before you leave. Subscribe to my channel if you are new and you love seeing videos like this. I'll be doing tons more and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.